This is the solution to written homework 46. So there's some nice story there that's true, but it's just not so relevant to the actual solving. So for part A, we're asked to solve this differential equation. So dr ds is k over s. Uh, we can solve this differential equation by separating variables. So dr is k over s ds. <coughs> the variables are now separated. So we can solve um, by anti-differentiation. So our antiderivative of dr is antiderivative k over s ds. So now k is just uh, constant. So antiderivative of dr is r. <laughs> antiderivative of k over s is k log absolute s plus some unknown constant c. However, because the <clears throat> stimulus is positive, that means that we can drop the absolute value, and that is the general solution. <clears throat> so for part b, find the particular solution when you know that uh, that's a solution. So what this is saying is we want to determine C given <coughs> this piece of information. <coughs> so when we plug in <coughs> S is S naught and R is zero, that's supposed to be a solution. So plugging that in, <coughs> that's R is zero equal to K log uh, s naught plus c <coughs> and therefore c is negative k log s naught <coughs> now we can plug that back this information back into here <coughs> To determine that R is K log S minus K log S naught. So now the K's can be factored out. So R is K log S minus log S not, <clears throat> and then just as it says in the hint, that can be simplified to R is K multiplied by log of S divided by S not using a log rule, and that's the answer to the exercise. <clears throat>